screen is going to start any any second now. And first of all, you're going to see is the, is the new camera angle. We've done the new camera angle based on broadcast elements. It's really intelligent. When the ball slightly zooming in there as well. Nice little touch. Thank you for doing that for me. Yeah, exactly. So you spotted it. So when the ball is at the far side, the camera will actually pan up and zoom in. As it comes to the near side, it will do the same thing. It's just as you playing it through, fantastic as well. When the ball is in the air as well, oh, there. see him complain? Left well. his foot in there You'll as well. You'll see a lot of human animations going on. We've got three times more animation in the game, um, but we've actually brought in a lot of the human side of it. And that side is is the more complaint to the referee. Hey, why don't I get a foul? Uh, hey, why not pass me the ball? I'm in space and things yeah. like that. When the ball's in the air now, you're going to see our new aerial battles where the, where the uh, players collide. We've got a brand new collision system in the game. Okay, Pez hasn't had one before this ad advance. Now he calculates when people get hit and stuff. Yeah. And we take it into the air as well. So when you challenge for the ball, it's not just a case of either you win it or you don't. Yeah. You can impact it. If you're a little guys. And yeah, before uh, it's like you win, you lose, and it's kind of almost feels scripted, even though it's not. But now it feels like more kind of fluid, I guess. Yeah. Oh, great chance that then. Was, just wide. Well, you quick. know what? That was a cutback. That was naughty. Yeah. Oh, like these them sweaty goals. goals. You've got to be careful with them sweaty, sweaty goals. goals. You've got to be That's careful. What call it. it is. They're Sorry. sweaty. But obviously, as you said, it's been, it's been 20 years now since uh, Pro Evo. I still remember the, the Ravinelli and Paul Ince oh, version. Oh, ISS now, yeah. Yeah, I've nice. been playing since then. Obviously, you know, Master League was, has always been one of my favourite oh, modes. And I imagine that's a lot more in this version. This yeah, year. actually, yeah. Because it's our um, anniversary year as well. What we've, what we've really wanted to do is, is actually focus on making sure that we're listening to our fans and they've been asking for us a new Master League for a while yeah. now. So what we did this year is totally revamped it. We totally changed it. Uh, we've got brand new menus and the menu pictures feed in from what's happening in your season if you score a great oh, goal, nice. if you win a derby and things like that. When you sign players, oh, there as well. Oh, very naughty. He's not happy there. But yeah, when you sign players, you get a, a press conference. Really? As manager, change clubs. Stuff like, like that, that is just so good. I really get into the manager mode, yeah. career mode. You really kind of want to pretend that I'm a real manager. So I think yeah. that's a great feature. I think, I think the cool thing as well is that it lets you micromanage things as well. So I mean, some people don't want to get really stuck in. Yeah. They just want to experience it. Well, we've got micro things like that as well. But Master League, people want to feel the life as a manager, not just in one one club but through their career so you can go to different regions let's just say you're in south america you win a league there you win the libertadores yep. you can then go to europe and win champions wow league. you can then go and manage your national team be the, be the England manager yeah there's just this all these options and all these options and careers that you can actually live through and you know they, they've still got classic players like miranda and costello are they still there or have they been you know what you? That's something that we get asked quite a lot of, even if they could <laughs> start. We actually made them agents in my club. Oh, my God. So <laughs> so they, they've moved on in their careers now, like yeah. years later. And but we remembered what position they actually play. Yeah. So Costola's the guy who gets you the strikers. No, it's the, your quicks, the quicks. <laughs> yeah, right yeah. strike. I remember yeah. them. Miranda and Miranda, yeah, they, yeah. they get you the midfielders. And, and who was the Scottish right back as well? Mm. Effington or something? Not Effington, he's a real player. But oh, oh no. my God, there was. Dude. I should know this. It all comes flooding back. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm yeah. So much yeah. Uh, prover, but you say like the graphics look super good and the, yeah. the shirts and the yeah, the motion. When you actually kick the ball as well, you might have spotted the grass coming up. Yeah, as well. yeah. So when they kick it and stuff, and all uh, those things allow for a more complete experience, obviously. Yeah, see that then the way yeah. that you fell with the, with the physicality. What you're noticing as well right now, see so the guy running. Everyone is moving naturally. It's the new intelligent player AI, um, and what you'll see is is that you don't have to forcefully trigger a run. Mm. You don't have to press a button to make the guy run It happens anymore. more nationalistic. Yeah, you don't have to hold a button and a pressing a button for, oh, nice trick, uh, for, for a one-two. Uh, things should be feeding off you. Players play off each other, look into space. But it's not just about scoring the goal. So what will happen is a guy will come off the forward line to support the midfield to make that pass as well, uh, to, to give you That's an option. That's a great chance. Oh. Oh. Just, just wide. Just wide. Great header chance there.